Welcome. Welcome to On the Scene with Patricia McDougall and Dr. Rue over here. And we're going to introduce everybody in a minute. But in the meantime, we want to first start out with Nassam. He's going to open it up with a beautiful song that he has um, provided for us today. And then I'll tell you who everybody is. Cause you can be the cash, I beat her up, bang, you be the match, I'll be the fuse, boom, paint it, baby, you can be the booze, I'm the rock, put it, baby, you can be the news, cause you're the cigarette, and I'm the smoker, we raise the bed, cause you're the joker, truth told, you are the joke, I can be the blackboard, you can be the talk, I can be the, even when the sky comes falling, even when the sun don't shine, I got faith in you and I, so put your pretty little hands in mine. Even when it's down to the wire, babe. Even when it's do or die. We can do it, baby, simple and play. Cause this love is a sure thing. All right, all right. Yeah, that all right. Was nice. Nice. Wow, what oh he's wow. Well he's an well up and coming done. artist. He's from upstate New York. He my performs God. everywhere, but oh my goodness, you are the bomb. Thank you. And we're gonna try to play that little video of him, um, a little song we have that you also recorded, right? Live? Yes. Yes, absolutely. And yeah. last night he was at one of our um uh, African exclusive black tie gala last night and you did a fabulous job. Oh, thank you so much. Thank oh you. man! Yes, he was on the scene. Absolutely I'm, I'm on the a scene. I like how you took the faith into that marketplace. I, I see your faith is all in that song. Yeah, man. Always, always. Wow. Y yes, yes, truly. We we had to have him here on the set today, you know, because I thought he was awesome. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, for me. and thank you so much. You want to just you tell a little bit about yourself, real quickly? Okay, uh, my name is Nassim Sadiq from upstate New York. I've been here in the DMV area for about. Five years, you know, I love music, love the guitar, and I'm just trying to take advantage of every opportunity laid before me. Well, where can they find you? Where can they find Facebook? me? Facebook? Yes, Twitter? Uh, social media? <laughs> Instagram is Nassim, N-A-S-I-M-714. My mixtape is N-A-S-I-M-714.bandcamp.com. Uh, Facebook is Nassim Music, N-A-S-I-M Music. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you. Well, welcome. We're happy that you were able to join us on the show today. So we're going to move along because we're up for time. So um, we're going to, right now, we're going to introduce Sylvia. Oh, oh my, oh, Dr. Oh, Rue. Why don't you this. tell us? I know she's the first black female impersonator, right? And entertainment. She's been, she was on the scene back in the 70s, but she's still on the scene now. You know, she's, a, she's just, she's just awesome. But I'm going to have her. Ruth, tell you a little bit about her. Dr. Ruth, why don't you say two words? Sylvia. She's going to say She's going to say it all. Thank Welcome. you. Thank you. You Thank are you. on the scene. Yes. With Patricia Verdugo. Yes. You know she's a celebrity photographer. Absolutely. Who so she's on the scene Verdugo? everywhere. Who doesn't, who doesn't know this woman? We, 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 oh, we, oh I, I told her, I told her we're going to have to so dig awesome. and make sure to see if we find any pictures of you because I sent her so much information. I on have you. a picture of her. I, 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 I do have a picture of her. They're going to show you. what I did. Don't, I pulled your page. Don't you worry. But we're going to get some <laughs> real pictures today. <laughs> uh oh, oh. Hey. hey. Photographer in the house. Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. So, yeah. Not only are you the first African-American woman to write for Saturday Night Live, but mm -hmm. also the first African, um, African-American female impersonator. Let's change it. Let's but change it to yes. impressionist. Impressionist. Oh, yes. Because mm. <laughs> down through the years, they told me an impersonator is a, is a man who is a implies that he's a woman. Oh. An impressionist does imitations of people. Okay, we don't want to. So there we go. But I mean, you know, they want me to. We don't want a big, ma want want a big mama uh, or <laughs> a Tyler Perry. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. It's cool, though. I, I just always. You. I love I saying you. that. I, love I got you. It. I, love it. I got you. And, and Patricia was saying that um, uh, the 70s, you're right. I started, yeah, she started. I did my very first professional engagement at the, at the, at the uh, at Constitution Hall in 1969. Wow. So I came awesome. up with Jay Leno and David Letterman and Robin Williams and all these guys who had not even made it yet. And I know Hello. You, you, know, real, real you know, you know, you're going to full form. And I'm the yeah. first, I'm the first African-American female impressionist in the history of this country. Oh, the my. Country. In, the in the country. Did you hear that? And you spell my name N-A-S-I-M. No, I'm only ah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> well, we're gonna let her. Can we? We're gonna. Can we play that bio for you? Because I know we have a 
little something on you. So we're oh, going to just do. play that real quick. Okay. It's All the right. one that has uh, the intro. It's it says, home. it's Once home. Upon a Yeah, time. hello. <laughs> Now we're gonna let Thank her. You. You, you saw the little intro, so let her show you what she knows best. Oh my goodness! Because <laughs> she is the bomb. <laughs> well, um, I've been doing this now, like I said, since the '60s, and uh, I am currently the subject of a documentary that they're filming okay. uh, on 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 the book. Almost oh. there, almost, which highlights and chronicles everything that that that. Uh, little piece just showed you, and uh, Red Fox was my very first manager. Oh, well, you! Huh. I was just telling Dr. Rue awesome. earlier today that Red Fox signed me uh, to an exclusive management contract back then. Wow. But ne- today, I'm I'm still working, doing a lot of churches, organizations, uh, uh, and let, let me show you what I do in, in corporations and all that other stuff. I tell so you. I was delighted <laughs> when you said last night that. N A S I M seven one four. Oh my goodness! You have such a humble, wonderful spirit. I, I think it's only Isn't he you awesome? know natural for me to just do that. You know, you. just wonderful. It. So, what I I do two of my favorite impressions. Mm-hmm. Nobody asked me to do an impression, but how about this? I just come on out and do it. Hey, well, we I want you to do all, anything everybody. you want because we want. We she's live here. You know, we are really excited <laughs> that scene? she's here because we're on a scene. <laughs> Thank you. And and uh, one of the one of the uh, things that I want to point out, um, Whitney Houston, who is we all we yes. love, yes. took me on the road with her back when she was just the biggest thing in the entertainment industry. There were only two people on the show. I opened the show. Whitney Houston closed it. Hmm. Period. No in betweens. No extras. No nothing. It was just the two of us. We did twenty three major cities. So. We released the book three months before she died. Wow. So I never even got a wow. chance to tell wow. her about the two chapters. She has two chapters, meeting Whitney and then hanging out with Whitney Houston. Oh and my, wow, my experience with Whitney Houston. Oh, yeah, we didn't, we didn't, oh, yeah, we didn't, get, didn't to get to that. She was saving that for the show on the scene. Oh, we, didn't, we, didn't <laughs> the Khan, we didn't get to get the Shaka Khan. Shaka Khan, oh, we didn't, get, well, we didn't get to Gladys Knight because oh. yeah, we did get Gladys Knight. That's correct. And so the one thing I did want to share with you guys right quick uh, in 1979 at the legendary Apollo Theater, Richard Pryor was s- slated to host the Muhammad Ali Rose. Yeah. Muhammad Ali was the biggest yeah, name in the he, world. He, yes, he was. At the time, the only yes. other person they wrote more books about was, was Jesus Christ. All right, now. Right. Muhammad Ali is number Amen. two in line. Wow. So they were roasting wow. Muhammad Ali Amen. at the legendary Apollo Theater, and Richard Pryor couldn't do it. What? So to make a long story short, because the story is in the book, she ended up. Oh my goodness! They ended yes. up hiring me to replace Richard Pryor. Is that oh. right? Which was the biggest, one of the biggest moments for me. And you tore it up. Oh, oh they had that clip on air. We have to show oh. that we later. Have, well, you know what? And I just <laughs> recently, last year, okay. obtained a copy of the actual roast, the oh film my. of the roast. And there I was. I was. I didn't know I was that cute. Oh, I was so cute. cute. What? <laughs> Nobody <laughs> told me that. They should have said, "Tell me, you just as cute as you can be." They never oh, told my, me. That. Oh my! <laughs> well, we're gonna have to get that, but we we want you to show us something. Okay. That, you know, right, hey, well, we, about, hey. About, we, yeah, yeah. You, you know, we're in the nation's capital. Yes, in DC. And yeah. we love how you know how we love our first lady. Here. Oh, yes. absolutely. Oh, we do. So love her. I love to see her do that. Oh, yeah. So, she yeah. can do that too. What? I'm gonna let uh, she, Mrs. She, Michelle Obama. Come out. Michelle, fact, you in the house? She was just she was just visiting <laughs> you know, people spontaneous. She was going okay. to different schools because they had gardens. Okay. And she was showing up on, on folks and just saying, I'm here. And that means 
it was that amazing. is awesome. Well, we got to get you up at Howard. You know, I would love to do Howard. Absolutely, I'm going to let them Just know she's going to be in the house. I mean, we're right across the street, so we got to bring you across the street. And if if <laughs> I, I hear Michelle is Michelle Obama out there, well, actually, that's Whoopi Goldberg. Come Whoopi. on, in, Whoopi. Whoopi. Come on in, Whoopi. Come Whoopi. Come on well, in. we got a whole bunch of folks coming up in here. You know. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Ah. My name is Sylvia Tremor Morrison, and I am absolutely delighted to be here tonight. That daggone girl, Monique, I just want you to understand one thing. Now I'm serious. You know what I'm saying? Let me explain something to you, player. It's Michelle Obama. Miss Whoopi Goldberg. Hi. This is Whoopi Goldberg. Jane Hathaway. Jethro. Ellie Mae, I'm absolutely delighted to be here tonight. Thank you so very, very much. All right. Wow. Can we just, real quickly, can you just give them one piece of your, you because you're here, Ma we want to just hear Obama something. Is Michelle is good. Well, how about real fast. Yeah. Hey there, look who we got on the screen. Oh, my God. Look at you guys. <laughs> look at you guys. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> Thank you, Patricia. I am so, you know, you know, I'm so glad that I'm here today because my show comes on tomorrow, just before yours comes on during, you know, well, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but we on the scene. We, we on, on the scene. scene. We yes, on the we scene. Are. We are. In wow. We can't get enough, but we, we just love her. Oh my God. Thank, Thank you. you so much for Thank joining you. us Thank today. So, so we're going to wait. I want her to do. Another one real quick because we Michelle up Obama. against that. Okay. Michelle. Oh, he's gonna do Michelle. She's gonna do Michelle. And then we got we got a visit. We got Dwayne Lomac on the line. But we she she has to do Michelle can we, first. Can we, can we go straight to Dwayne while can I have to Okay, yeah. Dwayne yeah. Come She's gonna so put Michelle, come back. Well, okay. welcome, welcome, Dwayne. How Another are you? One of my guests. I am great in loving this show. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Canada is in the house. house. Canada is wow. in the house. Wow. Wow. Really? Canada's I, in I the got, house, y'all. I gotta tell you guys, this show is off the chain. All right, man. <laughs> we take the good chain. Do you hear it? Oh my. <laughs> so we're gonna yeah. just we're just gonna entertain you. We we you're we gonna entertain it. us again, huh? We love it. We I, love well, it. You know, I'm gonna do the best I can. You know the Lord always blesses me, so Amen. you know I gotta give him his due first. Before I go anywhere else. That's, That's all right. right. So we're gonna we're gonna bring it right on to um, One Nation, um, right? That the YouTube version of what is it called here? But I, I mostly want to let people know he's firstly known as. And, and oh, Locke, yes. I want to share. Yes. I want you to share a little of your testimony. We talked about this. Okay. I want to share a little testimony because everybody just knows you as the drummer for yes. the Dramatics, and but <laughs> we have a history. You're not just locked down. He's also locked down. Product. He has songs. He has a group called One Nation. The, and the One, Nation. One Nation that That's has right. airplay across. But I, I really want you to share a few, a little bit about you. Maybe not more. What we got about? Two minutes. Two one, minutes. one and a half minutes. Maybe I'm a 30 sorry. second commercial yes, about you, please. and then go and we'll go right into One Nation. Yes. Okay. Um, the One Nation. Well, uh, yeah. But, uh, you know, I, I think I, I spoke on this once before. And I, I just want to just. just go back just a little bit and just just let you guys know how I came up with the song One Nation. Okay. Uh, I happened to be in church one day and uh, the band played for a young lady. He, she's a minister and she goes over to the West Indies and she uh, she she preaches over there. 
Cool. But she's blind. Mm-hmm. Uh, excellent lady of God, okay, can preach her heart out. And we were playing behind her. She kept saying, one nation, one nation, one nation. I was like, okay, all right, you know, cool, one nation, you know. <laughs> so I happened to be in prayer one day. And while I was in prayer, God said to me, write a song called One Nation. I had to look up and say, are you talking to me? I was unbelievable. Well, anyway, I went home and did the music. And when I did the music, I gave it to the young lady and told her exactly what I wanted to do with it. She came back with it. And when she came back with it, uh, we had wrote the song One Nation. Uh, and we did it off of a group. Uh, the, the, the group name is The One Nation. All right. And once again, the song is One we're Nation. Gonna, we're we're going to play that in a it moment. It gets confused sometimes. You got The Nation, yeah. One Nation, and then you got One I, Nation. I know. Right. All right. I know. But, All right. you know, I want to tell everybody right quick. I know we're on, uh, you know, against time. Time, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, this song is a worldwide song. It's not a black song. It's not a white song. It's not a Chicano song. I, let me forgive me for saying that because I, I, I don't want to call them. I, I just Hispanic nation. OK. All right. I don't want to offend anybody, you know. In, 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 so forgive me if I if I did. But this song, I want to be a worldwide song. And it was written to be a worldwide song. OK. OK. So, so. can we do we have that video of the one nation? Uh-huh. We are going to we're going to bring you to that video and we're going to play that one the one nation right it's called one nation peace and love yes (laughs) all right Detroit, Michigan. Ferguson, Missouri. I believe that we could be together as one underneath the sun. If we really tried to put a different set side Detroit, Michigan Ferguson, Missouri That we could be together as one underneath the sun. If we really tried to put our differences aside, no race, no creed, no color. One family of one One nation of love One nation Underneath the sun Steve Utash from Detroit, Michigan One nation Living as one Living in love One nation of peace, one nation of joy. Mike Brown from Ferguson, Missouri. United in love. Every man stands for one another. Reaching out to lend a helping hand. 
We have unconditional love. Steve Utash, Mike Brown, peace. Welcome back. Wow. My, my, nice, my. Lock. Lock, nice. You are the bomb. Beautiful. Very beautiful. Wow. I, you know, thank you guys. But, you know, I'm trying to get this out to the world. I want the world to realize that we need to, to come back to, to one nation. We're, 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 not, we're not one nation at all anymore. We're all on individual status. We're all on individual land. We're all on individual mind. But we need to come back together right and that's what that song is all about bringing us all back together we appreciate that much love and thank you so much and thank like you. I, I love how you took the faith into the marketplace man great job thank you uh, i'm i'm trying and, and with you guys I'll, I'll even be able to do a better job with taking it into the marketplace so thank you guys for just having me well, we're going right. to bring you back on another day. How about that? Because we need you to play something for us on the drums. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, okay, and, and, I'll and, do and, that. And, Thank and, you. Anytime, anytime you guys want me to come back, just call me. You, you, uh, you and Rue both have my number. And you guys got car <laughs> blood. You, I, I, put you guys, I put you guys right up under guys. So when y'all call, I'm going to answer the phone. Oh, my. That's, <laughs> pretty, that's a good one. <laughs> Okay. Tell, tell Miss Sylvia I love I love her work. She is fantastic. Thank you, darling. We got to put a show together, and Z One Nation got to open up for you. All right. All right. Oh wow! <laughs> he put you out there now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Lock. We'll talk. And um, Thank you guys. also, Lock. Like, next time, Lock. Like, okay? like, next time we have you back. We want you, I know you have a rap song that's on that album. Yeah. So we want to bring yeah. you back since we're Listen Vision and, you know, we're we going to work it out. Yeah. We, we, right. we might play right. it still at the end. We just press for time now, but we might play right. that song. We might play that song and also yeah. show a picture of you on the scene with us at the last event here and at the Constitution Hall. All right. All right. Yes. And we might show thank some pictures too, but for now, we love yeah. you and thank you. We thank out, my you. friend. Thank All you. right, thank, All right. You. thank you, guys. God thank bless. you. All right. Well, we have with us Doctor, Doctor. Everybody's Doctor up in here. We have the co-host here, <laughs> Jan Duplain. I'm gonna call her superstar. Remember, she's the ambassador. So she has some things she wants to share with us today on the scene. Oh well, I'm so excited to be here. I'm so glad. Wow. To be here. Hey, good to see it's you. A wonderful energy and to meet <laughs> Sylvia. Who I've heard so much about the fabulous. Oh Sylvia. yes, you hear that beautiful <laughs> music about wholeness and bringing people together, which is what my work is about in Washington. Absolutely. With, as I, we've talked about it last week, I'll mention it a little bit for those who didn't hear it last week. Um, I work in the international diplomatic community of Washington. We are an international city, an international cultural city in Washington, mm -hmm. D.C. We have more embassies here than anywhere in the world. Yes, and mm -hmm. once a year during May, which is uh, proclaimed by the mayor, International Cultural Awareness Month, we have a, an event called Passport D.C. One passport. You can travel around the world. You can go to Haiti. Hey, wow. what? Yeah. Represent, represent. represent. Haiti represent. You can, to, you can go to Belize. Belize, what? I got pictures of Belize you now. You can go to Thailand. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Thailand in the house. <laughs> in Thailand. Oh, we're here in Africa. Africa. We need to buy, yeah, we need to so, <laughs> But it's, it's, we have about 50 embassies that participate. They open the doors. It's very unique here in Washington to have, they open the doors to the public, and we have 30,000 thousand people that's come in oh so goodness. it's a it, it is exactly what your message from your from your beautiful uh, entertainer performer who said it's about bringing us One all together nation. absolutely yes. we, we're a global world we are all in this together that's why i love this show patricia oh Thank yes you. yes because so, we can share <laughs> anyway for any of you who are here in washington dc may 7th is the Around the World Embassy Tour from 10 to 4. The doors open, no fee. It's open to the public, no cost whatsoever. Bring family, bring friends, and you start a DuPont Circle. You walk up Embassy Row, go up to the top International Circle. Anyway, it's a wonderful opportunity. That's the first weekend is the Around the World Embassy Tour, and the second weekend is the European Union, when you have 28 of the European Union countries open. Anyway, the, the whole month is filled with different activities. There's an Asia Heritage, Heritage Month. 
I mean, uh, weekend. So anyway, I invite one and all to come to this. And uh, Well, I will surely be there with my I camera. Yes. Jen, Jen yes. I want to ask you a question. Yes. How did you get the ambassador to pull off that jewel? He let you keep oh, that jewel. That Is that the jewel? He let you. You got your hands on that jewel. Excuse me, I'll just remember um, the ambassador has to say he had bought the jewel. I know, I know. How, how did you get that jewel on your wrist? Wow. Well, you we got had, we had with the ambassador. Huh? We weren't here. We had the ambassador from Botswana here last week, yes, you did. and um, mm -hmm. that they have the second largest diamond in the world that they found in Botswana, mm -hmm. and. Prior to that, she got South it. She Africa. snuck it out. She snuck it out the embassy. That's hilarious. You know what? This out was given to me. See, I'm in your lane, Sylvia. <laughs> this was given to me the other night. I am at the National Press Club. I have a friend there named Monique McSween, who is the mm -hmm. communications director at Meridian International Center. Yes. I said, Monique, I love that. And she goes like oh, this. My oh, my goodness. I oh, love let her. Let me tell you. Monique, I love her. Oh, I'm, I'm, love so, her. I'm so glad our next guest coming is from Nigerian descent because you know Nigeria, that's what they do. If you, you love something, oh, if you amazing. say, I like that, because I have friends all over the world, very good friends, so my Nigerian, they will give it off of your hand. Give me five. And that's Nigeria. what you do. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I would have tried that. So that's what you did. Jewelry. Oh, yeah, that is a custom. You don't say a no. tie. They take it off and take give it, it to you. Right. I need you for all of my friends and listeners, May I, 7th, I want you guys to meet. I'm going. I oh, you're be going? There. Oh, oh I'm I'm out. she's oh, coming. God. You know what? Oh, listen, you guys come on. And I think, uh, Patricia, are you? Are, I'm going to be in there. Of course. We have that camera on the scene. On the scene. Let me tell you this. I actually have attended the passport, DC. From the past couple of years, and I have to say that it's quite interesting. You have brought so many interesting different uh, culture, different dance performance from different parts of the world. Yeah. Uh -huh. So that's awesome. You got to come on. You yeah. got to be there. Nice. On, the the scene. Scene. on the scene. On the scene. Thank you. Look at you. <laughs> so oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. Oh. On the scene. Well, oh. she's always on the scene. Shantana knows how Shantana. to party. She's always in the house. Okay. You take some awesome pictures. Yeah, thank you. Oh, oh wait, are we looking at photography first? Yeah. No, we're, we're going to show nice. some more. <laughs> but in the meantime, oh, because we're on the scene. On the scene. That's Patricia's yes, photography. That's her work. She's the she's the really the greatest she's photographer the in. Well, she that's really, you know that's the word on the street. Really the word is. on the street. The word I told them I was coming up here. That's oh, yeah, they were like, oh, oh, yeah. oh Patricia girl. the bomb on the street. Hey, map. well, okay. We, okay, so we we're gonna move along because uh, we have a lot to do. We want to introduce somebody real quickly because we have somebody calling in. Um, can you, Shantana? Please. Uh, one of our next get actually flew so all the way from one? Nigeria. Oh. Yes. He was sure one is. of the speaker oh, last great. night as the uh, exclusive black tie African wow. uh, energy oil we and gas uh, gala last night. Yeah. So let me introduce you to uh, Mr. Joshua Onifan Raymond. Yay. Yeah, we'll find a seat for you here. Yes. <laughs> We're going to sl slide over. We, we, oh. So, so Mr. Oh, okay. Joshua last night has shared with mm -hmm. some of the, uh, the the guests last night at the gala yeah. about, Sorry about that. <laughs> the movement in Africa and all of the um, Welcome. changing that's going on down there. So before I um, uh, continue to uh, interview you, I'm going to read a little bit bio. Oh, yeah, real, real short, because we're pressed for like so time. Yes, please. Well, you are actually a successful banker at the uh, Sterling Bank, and seems like you have done a lot of funding and supporting for some of the businesses in Africa, as well as some of the business here in America. So would you like to collaborate that, elaborate that a little bit? Yes, please, and, and mention the event last night, the African dinner. Okay, thank you very much. Um, you've done the introduction. Uh, my name is Joshua Nifadi from Nigeria. You're talking Africa. to the mic. Uh -huh. Yeah, honestly. Can um, you say that again? Which one? Uh -huh. Yeah, my Which name is Joshua Onifade from Nigeria. I'm a banker from Nigeria. Welcome. And uh, honestly, I want to appreciate um, this opportunity you are giving to me to to speak to the people of uh, Washington. It's an honor to have yeah, you. as per yesterday program, it was a wonderful program. It was Basically, awesome. I came around all there over. There you go, right, right there. there. Wow. <laughs> on the scene. On the scene. All the way in the USA. Yeah. Welcome. 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 My God. Thank, thank, I had to put that out there. there. Yes, please. That's a, that's a good one. That's a good so one. So you were one of the sponsors for the event last night or the yeah, company? I was, yeah. I was one of the 
speakers. Speaker. Oh, yeah, he Thank definitely you. was the speaker. Yeah, speakers, yeah, and everything. Yeah. We appreciate that. And we're happy that you were here to come on the scene. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, that was awesome. We, 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 we didn't want to miss this one. Yeah. Tell us a little more about you. About your name. Very quickly. Uh huh. You know, yes. A little bit about you. Yeah. You see, what do you I do have back a lot home? of friends. So, the first thing I ask is, what is the tribe? You know, I have plenty of chiefs that blessed me. Yeah, interesting. And, you know, so you know I understand. Yes. Yeah, I. Yeah, Joshua Nifade from Nigeria. I had my first degree in business uh, administration at the University of Illinois. I also had my first, second degree there. Then immediately after my second degree, I came into the world of banking. Wow. And um, the last 12, 13 years, uh, uh, that's what I've exactly I've been doing. I've been f funding indigenous companies. You know, understand. Funding, yeah. Yeah, that's funding awesome. Different projects, right. um, uh, financing power plant, um, building them. Um, um, refineries, <coughs> tank farm, you know, I've been contributing my quotas and it's been fantastic. It's been, it's been a wonderful experience. Wow, that's Nigeria awesome. Nigeria has always it's been a big resource. Place. Specifically, one of the sponsors of yesterday's program, yes. you, you, you understand that we funded him. Oh, that was we nice. Him, yes, yeah. with the acquisition of um, um, oil blocks. Wow, oil. oh, yes, it was about the oil and gas. We've contributed yeah. them massively. Well, we appreciate it. We truly do for you coming and joining us and, and, and having you on the program today. And you can always find sponsors for our program because we welcome that here on the show, and, you know, to bring people, key speakers that want to get the word out, whatever they're doing. So we welcome the opportunity for them to join us on the show. And they don't have to be list here in the U.S. They can be outside the U.S. as well. Are you living here now? or No, no I'm still around. I'm going to leave by um, Thursday. He's, he's, oh, vis Thursday. he's a visitor. Oh, yes, okay. yes. People who are away in last oh, my night for the God. Oh. Oh, yes. Does yes. the Sterling Bank have a specialty? Is there a specialty? Um, a yes, specific yes. specific area? Where we, we fund, um, <laughs> we look at um, gaps. We, we look at gaps that we can fill. Understood. You understand them. Like uh, the program we had yesterday was basically on power. Okay. You understand? Africa, as a continent, we really need to come up in that regard. Okay. okay. You understand? For instance, specifically in Nigeria, we generate about 5,000 megawatts which okay. is not enough, okay. you know, to power the entire country. We would need about forty-five to 50,000 megawatts. Correct. Wow. You understand? That's correct. So, and Sterling Bank is positioned, and it's been doing a lot in that regard. If you listen carefully during the program yesterday, uh, between 2012, 2013, and 2014, mm -hmm. you know, um, government, federal government in Nigeria, mm -hmm. they sold some assets mm -hmm. to private individual. You understand? Right. Mm -hmm. uh, we call it a um, generate uh, generation asset and distribution asset. Sterling Bank financed most of the participants. Mm -hmm. You understand? And right. the, the the result is actually coming up. Oh, also, right. okay. uh -huh. yeah. also in the area of manufacturing, mm -hmm. area of infrastructures, they are mm -hmm. doing wonderfully. Wow, wonderfully. awesome. Wonderfully. Well tell them how they can find you. I mean if you want them to, you probably don't. They can find <laughs> you through the show. Yeah. <laughs> how about that? Never mind. <laughs> We don't want to give out too much information. <laughs> this is my new banker. Okay. <laughs> well, you have a great idea, innovative idea. I'm just that kidding. is you something that I'm sure yeah. the bank is, you know, looking for a way to help, you know, enhance and empower. empower. Yes. Yes. That's key. That's Thank a key you. important that we very, you know, emphasize in that. How do we empower the entrepreneur, the younger yes. generation? Yes. They are the future of Absolutely. the country. Yes. Absolutely. And I believe Nigeria is a world leader exactly. for, for resource coming. Like in, in this uh, energy space before uh -huh. now, in this uh, energy space before now, uh -huh. it was predominantly dominated by the foreign companies. Mm -hmm. okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. right. Now, right. we now look at it, it it's, it's not going to continue like this. Right. That's not. That's yeah, right. It's not going to continue like this. Too much resource and the, uh, apart from Sterling Bank, there are other banks in the country. We awesome. have close about 22 commercial banks. Right. And um, Central Bank of Nigeria is the one regulating them. Right? So they have played successfully to you know, increase the participation of indigenous company to right. come up, to empower That's individuals, right. Absolutely. to em empower indigenous company and they are doing very very well wow awesome. i commend you we for that. that we thank you yeah. wow yeah, we appreciate your work nigeria yes. will be part of this passport dc if you come back May yes 7th. please come back send come tell back. everybody yeah, about I, I, it I, I, I come around regularly oh wow, oh, wow. Around, like, wow. Regularly. good so yeah. we I need to take well, in 2015 I, 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 I was in the state twice mm -hmm. oh wow i had a program in harvard business school in mm -hmm. boston yeah. I actually met your president. I was one of the photographers when he came here to the U.S. Meeting you? 
Yeah, your yeah. president of your country. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Chamber Buhari. of Commerce. Yes, yeah. I sure did. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He, he came nice. to he came to DC last he year. He did. I was yeah, here. I was one of the photographers. Oh, yeah. interesting. On the scene again. The yes, during the African during summit. summit. Yeah. The US African okay. Well, summit. we're gonna um, not to change the subject, but yeah. we're pressed for time. So okay. um, we're gonna thank you for coming on the show. So can you show some pictures while we get um, Sylvia back over here? Um, show some pictures of Howard University because they had their homecoming in Charter Day, um, and. It would have it would be HU convocation uh, would be the photos that we're going to show real quick Absolutely. because I want to mention um, I'm still waiting for Michelle Obama. Oh yeah, Michelle is going to come in a minute, <laughs> right? We, we're going <laughs> to. I've been looking for Michelle Obama. Well, we're going to show some pictures from HU uh, convocation, especially the one that is um, the president um, and even oh. Hillary Clinton. Oh, Hillary? <laughs> yes. I'm waiting for Hillary Clinton. Either one of them. And they're going to be... <laughs> so, here, can you come over here? Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Okay. We're just going to show some pictures real quickly while we just transition out real fast. Okay. Yes, yeah, so here we go. That's the president of uh, Trinidad, along with the president, and also the guest wow. speaker yesterday. Who is that? Okay, welcome. Hold on. I didn't get your book. Hmm? I didn't get your book. Oh, right. That was Howard University. That's the president? Really? Yes. Oh. Oh, oh, oh my God! She's at the early learning program. That's Rahel's daughter. I had to take a picture of her because she's so gorgeous. <laughs> oh, right now, look who we have here, Sylvia. She's gonna just do an. Hello, hello. Who's there? <laughs> we were expecting somebody. We were. Who was that? Mm. On behalf of my husband Barack and I, we'd like to thank all the Nigerians who are here watching, and thank you for your presentation. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Patricia. Oh, wow, thank you. anytime, thank it's a you. pleasure having you here. Thank you, yes. thank you, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> and and, and, and if, if people don't forget to remember, this is my book, we're re-releasing it in about three weeks, but this is the original, all that stuff's in there. I'm delighted to be on your show today. This lady has such wonderful, wonderful Jan issues. Duplain. May 7th, I will be there. I will be there, and I'm bringing a rack of people with me, too, so we're going to be on the scene. On the on scene. The <laughs> what, Rue? What do you think about that? Oh, I love it. I love it. That's what oh, it's all my. about. Oh, my. Being on the my. scene with you. Yes, yes. Beautiful. Well, thank, thank you. We really appreciate it. Yes. Really appreciate it. So I don't show. know if we if, if if we have time to show any more pictures. Uh, Denise didn't join us today, but um, it would be nice um, to maybe show a picture of Denise because she was on the scene out there um, in California recently, and it's um, she was on the scene. So we wanted to show maybe a picture Denise of two. No, she's on the line, but we want to show her picture. We want to give a yes, shout out to her. She is. She's we over there with Izzy Wright. Hi. You know all these Girl. folks right here. Really? Little t- yes, that's right. Denise is on the scene. She's on the scene. She's not on the oh. phone, but she's on, she the, on scene. the scene. So wow. I had to give a shout out to her. You know, Denise is one church going woman, honey, and she's probably still in there. <laughs> it was um, so that's probably where she is. But we probably have her. We're for sure she's going to get on the show next week. I'm sorry she can't be here today. Yes. All right. That's all right. So, um, Shantana, can you just tell me just a few words about who you are? Introduce yourself. I know you didn't really, but can you just mention? Absolutely. I <laughs> have to say, who am I? Mm. I'm a daughter of God. Mm. That's my first. Wow. That's my father. All right. Right Good start. There. Good start. So one thing yeah, I have learned your faith is that in the marketplace. Uh, it's Sunday. It's Sunday. I just came back from church. And I have learned is that um, it's so important that when you follow your calling, Follow what God had planned to seize within you. Therefore, any challenging, any obstacle you have, you will overcome them. So my name is Chintana. I'm a co-founder of VFAC Island Private Equity. Wonderful. What we do is we connect ultra high network to the social impact project. And currently, we just launched a Empower Imagination. Mm. It is going to be a hub of where we bring the leader, entrepreneur, innovator coming together to make things happen. Very good. Thank so follow you. Follow us. Mm-hmm. Thank you. We will definitely look follow you. Look at so this is Shantana. And so last but least, I just want to mention what she's gorgeous. And I just want to mention one thing. We have five more minutes. Um, can we just show, it was um, Social Work on the Hill. And I definitely want to put a 
shout out to social workers on the Hill because they do so much for the community. And uh, Dr. Lewis, um, he did a wonderful job um, bringing all the students from Howard and all over from the various schools. And so if we can just show maybe one or two pictures of, um, of social work on the Hill, that would be awesome. Nice. So, you know, we had some key speakers. That was at the National Press Club, and that one was over there in the U.S. Congress. And Leah was in the house. She was holding it down. <laughs> my daughter, Leah. She's oh. not here today, but she oh. there she goes. There she, goes. Oh. she was she was one of my – she was my photographer in the house, you know, taking all those photos yeah. and stuff. I was stuff. about and, to say, I, and I came in only in for the scene. I only I came in for the lunchtime. I was looking for you. <laughs> Patricia, you do a lot for the community, too, don't try to – slide yourself up under the <laughs> table because I'm looking at the, this is my first time here and your guests have been phenomenal. This has been a very diverse group of people. Oh, really? I'm impressed. Well, we I'm hope impressed. you come back. We, we welcome you every week because we love, we love entertainment, especially yes. Sylvia. Oh, <laughs> fabulous Sylvia. Well, thank you so much and thank everybody for joining us on the show today. We probably don't have time to show any more videos, but Good. you want to say anything less? I, I'm I'm not, like Sylvia you know. to do another impersonation. Uh, I think we, I don't know how many we minutes time, we have to do another week for us. And can we close out with one? Sure, we can close. Three minutes. Three minutes. We got we got four oh, four we got, oh, oh. Stop it now. Stop it. Yeah, well, Sylvia, do your what? thing. We are live and on the scene. See, that's what makes this show unique. When we're on the scene, you can do that. Uh -oh, uh oh, ladies and gentlemen, when, did knock. when Patricia first said that I was from, <laughs> I did stuff back in the 70s. One of my favorite impressions was Jane Hathaway from the Beverly Hillbillies. <laughs> now, you guys, some of you who are watching may not know who that is, but it was an iconic television show. Jane Hathaway was the secretary to Mr. Drysdale, and she loved Jethro. She loved him. She absolutely loved him. Mr. Clopet, Jethro, Ellie May, I'm absolutely <laughs> delighted. <laughs> and one of the uh, people that I do on my show, I'm, I'm, I'm taking this show on the road to the HBCUs. And oh, hopefully Howard. Howard University. Oh, now hopefully Howard you will be, will be over there. <laughs> <laughs> They're um, watching. <laughs> I talk about in heaven all of the legends that have gone on. And one of my favorite legends, aside from Etta James, is Ella Fitzgerald. Because a lot of our youngsters don't know who Ella Fitzgerald is. Correct. Yeah. Well, if it wasn't for Ella doing her scatting, there would be no rapping. That's correct. So, oh. All right, young people. Scatting is rapping and rapping is scatting. Mm -hmm. uh. Scatting is rapping and rapping is scatting. Better have my money. Skiddly do chip out, I have my money. Skiddly boop doop do da doop 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 Wow, that's awesome. Well, on the scene, on the scene with Patricia McDougall, celebrity photographer and my co-host. I feel like I have everybody as my co-host today. Look at this. I love it, love it. I mean, we can't get enough. And my artist over here with that guitar, wow, he did an awesome job. Nassim, we thank you so much for being on the set. And our visitor from uh, South Africa, he was awesome, boy, I tell you. So thank you so much. Do you have anything to say? Uh, oh, Nigeria. Oh, yeah, I'm Wait a minute, I'm trying. Trying to get to South Africa, that's what it really boils oh, down to. But Nigeria. I want to go to Nigeria, too. <laughs> yeah, you know what? When he sat next to me and, and, and he said he was from Nigeria, I was going to say, I like your, your watch, I like your oh, jacket, you I like it all. You got to get the bankers right. You should right. ask better say, well, I would like to see if your guy would fund some of a project. That should be a question. Yeah, I do. Absolutely. You know me. I don't you waste no time. Okay. Jan? What he's, do no, what he's doing, and it's coming from out of Nigeria. Yes. Not coming from the United States. That's exactly. You caught yes. the great yes. point. Yes. That yes. is the point. It's mm -hmm. the Africans supporting the Africans. Africans. Well, we appreciate that, everybody. Well, I thank each of you for joining okay. me today. This was fabulous. And so we, we stay tuned. Chime in. There goes our artist. And thank Look you for joining us today. On the scene. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That dress is the bomb. Oh, so we just on the bond.